So what is essence? What is form? Essence, so says Aristotle, is that property or set of properties which makes something what it is and gives it its identity. The oakness of an oak tree, something along those lines. And all these ideas spill rather neatly into object-oriented programming, which we're going to explore in a few videos here, taking a look at classes in Python. So these are relatively more abstract and conceptual uh, pieces of, of uh, knowledge for Python here, but we're going to start with very basic building blocks and build to more complexity from there. So let's take a look. Okay, so when you define a class, what you're doing is you're making a blueprint, a template for creating objects of that class. And when you instantiate a class, you're actually creating the object. So what we've done here in this little script is just to find the class squirrel. And I've just given this class some properties. Uh, it's got four properties. You'll see a couple of them are strings. One of them is a list. Another is an integer. You can store arbitrary types of data in those properties. I've given you some things that I think are essential to a squirrel here. So this is a set of properties that if we make a squirrel, make an instance of this object that that new instance will have. This, however, doesn't make anything besides the instructions, the template, the blue paint. Pardon me, the, the blueprint. So if we run this, we go over here and we look at squirrel, which I named, it says class main.squirrel. Uh, okay, so it's, it's giving us what is there an address for the main method of that class. We'll get more into class methods in further videos. It's an important subject. I just want to do the very basics here. But all it's saying is that's just some instructions. That's just a method for making squirrels. So what we need to do to instantiate one is we need to, to give it a name. So we'll say Rocky equals oh, squirrel. And if we wanted to set it equal to the instructions, we would leave it as is. But we want to make an instance of a squirrel. So we'll give an open close parenthesis. OK. Now what's Rocky? Ah. Oh. Main squirrel Rocky is an instance. And we can look at the properties Rocky has using syntax like follows. So Rocky.color is tawny. Rocky.temperament. He is frantic, spastic, and nervous. So we can see we have a copy of that class. And in the same way, let's see, we can make another squirrel. We'll call him Greg. And Let's do some more looking at these things. Let's say Greg, is Greg equal to Rocky? False. So they are different instances of the same class. So I've now instantiated two objects. I've got two squirrels running around. They look very much the same. Uh, they, have, they have the same properties. But you'll see here, uh, we, can, we can modify those properties. So let's say we want to be more accurate to a certain trademarked piece of material that's out there in popular culture and say that Rocky's color is in fact gray, you can do that. And then if we take a look at it, it'll report back gray to us and it's changed. Oh, now we'll see that Rocky's number of limbs is the same as Gray's number of limbs, but their color now is different. So we have two objects, the same set of properties, but different individual properties, and, and they are different from one another. So this is a super basic rudimentary look at classes. You'll want to make your classes look differently than this, but this is how classes work. We give it a blueprint for making objects, then we can make those specific instances of objects, make individual ones, and they'll have the same form or the same properties, and as we'll explore in future videos, the same abilities. Well, let's wrap it up for now just leave it as it is relatively high concept stuff but we're going to flesh it out a little further with class methods in the upcoming video which will show you how to make classes do stuff and again this is ed for my bring back appreciate your patience with my stumbling attempts to teach you computer science concepts keep coming back keep subscribing keep sharing this with people and we will do our very utmost to make it worth your while